check this out, I'm going to show you all how to create the text inside of the text text effect. With that being said, just like always, get yourself a fresh new project of 3840 times 2160. Go ahead and press create. Once you've got yourself a new project, you want to go down to the half filled circle and then get yourself a solid color of any choice. So I'm just going to stick with a white color. Now that you've done that, you want to go to the text tool and make sure you are selecting a black color. You also want to make sure you set the font size to something like 14 pixels and get yourself a generic font of something like Arial. You can then left click on the screen, drag this out and then type in your text. Now to save a lot of time, I've just got myself a paragraph off a Photoshop wiki. But if you want your words to have a certain meaning, then just go ahead and type it yourself. But just keep in mind, you will need a good paragraph like this to fill it all in. Once you've done that, you then want to go to the first tool. And now you want to once again, go back to the text tool. Go ahead and get yourself another text above this one. And then you want to type in whatever the word that you want it to say. So I'm just going to type in text. We're going to highlight the text. And for this one, you want to set the size to something like 360. If you have the option for your text, you also want to change it to something much thicker. So for example, this text allows us to have a more thicker version of that text. So then you would just lower the size to make sure it all fits on the screen. You can then left click on here and then drag this down so it fits the text. Once you've done that, you want to go to the first tool. Go ahead and press Ctrl or Command and A to select it all and then center align your text. You can then press Ctrl and D to deselect it and you want to press the 5 key on your keyboard to lower the opacity to 50%. And from here what we can do is we can go to the text underneath. Now what you want to do from here is you want to make sure that you don't have any gaps and all of your text fits in nicely. Now that you've done that you can go ahead and Hold control, left click on your text thumbnail. You then want to hide the top one and then get yourself a mask. I hope this video was helpful. If it was, give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think of this video. And as always, I will see you all in the next one. Bye.